let's tee one up real nice because we're headed to Hamilton Trails Golf Club. And this is a nine hole golf course located in Mays Landing, New Jersey. And with just nine holes, there's not much golf to be played here, but there's a lot of great golf to be offered. So let's head to Hamilton, New Jersey, which is in the southern part of the state, and take a look at public nine hole golf course that stretches 3,265 yards. And we're starting off with number one here. That is a quick dog leg left. And here's number two, which is about 390 yards with water on the right hand side. One of the exciting parts about this golf course is you don't have to make a tee time. You just show up and walk on. It's, it's actually encouraged on their website. And the trails, most people get around within two hours. And I played very quick in the morning. I was the first, no, I was the second one to tee off. Someone, someone was there before me, but uh, no tee time was needed. Overall, the greens were pretty well. You really couldn't complain. Uh, one of the interesting parts about the clubhouse is you see the statue of the dog. Now, there's a dog that goes around the course. That's not the dog of the statue. That's the second dog that the owners had. Pretty cool story behind that, talking to him about it. Course plays about $20 uh, to walk it, and then I think it's about $25 to ride it. So, a very reasonable golf course for South Jersey. A lot of times when you go to these nine hole courses, it doesn't really feel like a golf course. And this one actually really does feel like a fun golf course to play. It would be amazing to see if they, they reached out and did more holes on it. But it's, you know, if you played this two times over, you'll have to pay two times. So if you're looking to just play nine holes, this is an incredible $20 deal. Uh, here we are with a little par three here. Um, took a driver off it just to kind of get some good footage. But for the most part, the course is really open for the driver. You can hit bombs on it all day. The course is a par 36, has a ranking of 34.7 and a slope of 123. Where you do hit a pretty good drive, you can find yourself in trouble just like on this. This championship length nine hole golf course was built in 1983 and was designed by Bill Sokol. Now the course is just a short ride from Atlantic City and Ocean City. It's pr pretty much a premier course for Ocean City um, on its website. I want to play once over because some of the holes you, you hit a great drive and you actually end up in trouble. Um, but one of the, my favorite parts about this golf course is probably the tee boxes. I decided on this course to pretty much move the tee boxes myself all the way to the back on all the holes just to make it a little bit more challenging to get that 3,000 yard mark from those back tees. Obviously, the fairways were pretty open. You could kind of spray the ball for the most part. Uh, if you hit it in the trees, you're not going to really find it. It's real thick. Of course, ends pretty nicely with this par 3 here with water on the left-hand side and the clubhouse on the right. Great golf course. Keep a lookout for more videos to come. This is World Twilight Golfer.